here in Portland, there's a huge need for affordable housing. We didn't believe that the people doing the affordable buildings were doing them affordably. And that's our mission, is to be able to get this out so that there's less money spent from the government to produce more units. We want to maximize units in a condensed area and make them efficient for the end user to you know, use less energy. All of those things are really important. What's really exciting about this particular project is that we were able to use some innovative construction methods that you know hadn't been used before. One of the reasons why we went with mass plywood panels is that it's very important to us to be able to build quickly and affordably. He came to us and said, I want to build the most units possible in the cheapest way. And so we studied a bunch of different options, prefabricated steel options with concrete on metal deck, uh, light gauge bearing wall buildings with slab on metal deck, and classic you know, conventional concrete construction. And the mass timber really just checked so many of the boxes. One of the things that I thought was unbelievable about it is it weighs a lot less than concrete. You know, the, the different types of building that you go up with at this height is always concrete or steel. Both of those weigh a lot more than mass timber. And that's what's, you know, driven our, you know, cost down is trying to stay away from those products. Now that we have these new building types that allow us to go up to 18 stories, it really opens the door to tap into the speed of construction and the prefabricated nature of these panels. This is a 12-story building that our first um, floor went down in April, and by the first week of August, we'll be all the way up to the top. Frankly, we're, we're beginning to compete with steel and concrete in a way uh, that we didn't really expect. It's fun to see the, the speed of construction really drive the cost down. We're going at a clip about one floor every eight days, doing approximately nine to 10 units per floor. We believe we're gonna be done in December of this year, which is just an incredible uh, schedule for any high-rise building. From our, our plumbers to our electricians to our mechanical people, they love not having to fit all of their stuff inside a joist cavity or some sort of drop ceiling. It's the tallest building in the United States of mass plywood and bearing studs. Imagine a part-time student that, you know, doesn't have a lot of income and is trying to go through school at the same time as he's got a full-time job and this is the sort of place he can afford. We love it because it, we're getting fast construction, but at the same time, we're saving the world. Thank you.